Hey everyone, it's Fortify Gaming here. I hope everyone's having a great day so far. So today we are going to take a look at update 2.9 for Mario Kart Tour. And of course, we are going to look at the tour preview. So yeah, let's go and hop into it. It's going to be a nice jam-packed video. And I want to go ahead and let you guys know that the official preview video will be coming this weekend. I'm going to be working on some awesome like reskins, some like future pipes, some packs. It's going to be a really fun video and it's going to be a first of like a kind for my channel. But I'm very excited. So I hope you guys will look forward to that. So yeah. So we're going to go ahead and start off by taking a look at the 2.9 update. Um, and again, I'm like, I'm like 99% of players will look over this. Cause let's be honest, who, who cares about the updates that Mario Kart tour releases are pretty bad. Like usually, <clears throat> you know what I mean? So there's a huge change. So in 2.9, it says an adjustment has been made so that starting with the next Kart pro, you can maintain your winning streak. If you place in second or third place, I can't tell you how many times that I've gotten uh, like two first place wins in a row and then like the third race I got second or third place like this is just gonna make this event so much more flexible and fun <laughs> Honestly, I am so down for this. This look this is just gonna be awesome This is just gonna make people actually want to play the cart pro, pro and I'm really glad they did this They probably looked at the data. They probably saw that most people didn't win cart pro But yeah, um, this is this is so good. This is just really good. I mean Kart Pro should not have been that, that hard to begin with. You know what I mean? It should have been... Because Mario Tur Kart Tour isn't supposed to be a hard, hard um, game. You know what I mean? So, yeah. I'm really down for this. Uh, I'm really excited. So, yeah. So, and maybe the next Kart Pro will be in the next future tour. Uh, I don't know. <clears throat> so, the, our next update is the race bounce adjustment. This doesn't really make sense to me, but it says the chance for opponents in a single player race to use the lightning or spiny shell items has been slightly decreased. Doesn't make sense. Honestly, uh, I can see lightning. I mean, I do get lightning a lot if I'm in last place, but the spiny shell, I, I can't even remember the last time I've gotten a spiny shell. So, I don't think that should have been decreased. Um, but yeah. I guess makes sense. And then here's an adjustment to Mario Kart Tour Gold Pass transfers. <clears throat> we have made an adjustment to transferring a Gold Pass across devices with different operating systems. It is now possible to transfer your Gold Pass benefits. You can transfer your items if you use the same Nintendo account you used on your previous device. Note, you cannot newly subscribe to the Gold Pass if your Gold Pass is still valid on a different operating system. If you're purchasing a new gold pass, please purchase it on once the val validity period of the gold pass on your previous device has ended. So just, you know, a little update to make gold pass transfers and all that a little easier. I'm down for it. Pretty cool. Uh, nothing, you know what I mean? And then they addressed a lot of issues, which is pretty cool. Um, so yeah. <clears throat> Um, so, when the coin box on Tokyo Blur 4 is used, the coins it releases may land outside of the course. Um, I don't know why they made, like, they made a note of that, unless, like, Tokyo Blur 4 is returning sometime soon. I don't know. Anyways, a bug affecting the amount of speed boost received from driving into an opponent's mushrooms or triple mushrooms while the opponent has a frenzy. Um, no, a speed boost will occur when a driver gets close to another driver that has a frenzy with mushrooms or triple mushrooms. So, pretty cool. <laughs> there was a bug in which drivers could get speed boost from driving to mega mushrooms from an opponent's frenzy. This should not occur. What? Wow, okay, I didn't know. I didn't know that that was a thing. Okay. A bug affected Shy Guys Ninja's animations in which when the character turned into a scroll, the bamboo leaves... Around the scroll were not displayed. Oh, interesting. Okay. When tapping the screen after a race to skip the result screen, the collection of grand stars or the new record that sometimes is not displayed correctly. And then uh, two more things. The game screen can freeze if the date and Mario Kart tour changes while frequently asked questions, tips and tricks, or news is displayed. And the last thing. After the sp suspension period for Gold Pass subscription ends on an Android device, you may not, you may be unable to resubscribe. And I've, for the last update, I've seen a lot of that. I've seen a lot of people complaining about that, so I'm glad they fixed that for all those people. But yeah, again, I'm a really solid 2.9 update. You know, a lot of awesome changes, some cool buffs, and they don't usually buff stuff. 
And then, of course, the biggest buff is to the Cart Pro, allowing second or third place. Yeah. So now, guys, it is time to take a look at the upcoming tour. So, yeah. The upcoming tour is the Sydney tour. Oh, yeah, bro. This, like, look at the top picture. This looks so cool. I'm going to go and take a picture of this. But yeah. Well done, Nintendo. Well freaking done. This, <clears throat> I'm sorry. This looks so cool, though. Wow, I really like this. So it looks like, oh my god. So it looks like we kind of like got like a little explore toad with um, like a little camera. We got oh, such a cute uh, baby Mario koala. And someone said that they wanted him to be like a full flesh koala. That'd be weird. Come on. Like, wouldn't that be weird for like someone, a baby to turn into a full animal? Like, no thank you. I, I think baby Mario looks cool as a little cute koala. And then we got... Uh, Rosalina swimmer sipping on a nice sweet uh, orangey drink looks pretty she's vibing heck yeah so I'm really looking forward to this tour um, uh, yeah it just I mean it looks it gives me Los Angeles tour vibes but oh my gosh it looks so beautiful like I don't know the colors are so vibrant I don't know I really like this tour but anyways guys let me guys know your thoughts about the 2.9 uh, update and the Sydney tour preview. So I'll see you guys later. And make sure you guys uh, keep a lookout for the Sydney tour like prediction video, which will not contain any commentary. Like I said, it's inspired by a YouTuber named Pengu. He's a really cool guy. Go ahead and check him out. Um, but yeah, I will see you guys later.